Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys how you can record your Streamlabs uh, audio for your games that you are streaming. So let's get right into it. Now for this, I'll be explaining how you can split your audios in Streamlabs for the desktop. And this is what we're going to be using for this, since you can select the game that you're currently running and you can record or stream the audio from that application. So let's get right into it. Firstly, what you need to do is, of course, enter the Streamlabs desktop app and you need to uh, enter a different source which is in this case application audio capture uh, which is uh, available in the newest version of Streamlabs. Uh, now uh, for this to work you do need to disable your desktop audio uh, which you can do and I'll be covering how to do this later. Uh, you can mute it uh, and that will be perfectly fine and you can add a source which is application audio capture uh, but yeah once you go into your sources and add the application audio capture uh, it will once you have it in your sources window, you just double click on it. And then once you're here, you'll be in the source settings. And once you're here, you can select the window that you want. In this case, as you can see, this person is running the Sims 4 and you can set up any other settings such as the device timestamps, the audio monitoring and everything. And that is pretty much it. Uh, now, as I've said, you do want to disable desktop audio sources in settings and audio, uh, or your stream will be hearing all your audio from your computer. Uh, and yeah, uh, you can also change other things, uh, which I will not be covering. You can easily check this out on the uh, article that I've mentioned, but this is pretty much how you can uh, enable your game audio uh, playback. And yeah, that is pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll be seeing you guys next time.